Hi there, Thomas here. So today I'm going to speak about my food technique. Let's get started. When I play slow tempos, I'm using the single stroke technique with my heel up. I hit the pedal with the front of my feet. The motion is made by my leg and not fully with my ankle. Like this. When I play fast double bass, I tried to learn the Hilto technique back in 2012, but with time, some slide motion was added to it. This technique is better known as the double stroke technique, just as the one with the hands. Two hits are made with each foot, one after the other. The first stroke is made with the flat foot, and the second stroke made with the toes. Alan did foot by foot, step by step, slowly then faster, to know and understand how the motion is made. Here is how you can assimilate it. You have to feel the motion, you do not have to think about it. At the end, it should look like a waveform, just like that. Here is how it goes on the pedals, and you can see the foot blaster in action. You can use this technique for slow tempos. This example is at 180 BPM. For middle tempos, this one is at 220 BPM. For fast tempos, like this one at 250 BPM. For extreme tempos and higher, this one is at 270 BPM. You can of course play triplets rhythms. You can alternate fit to play jerky rhythms just as bleed by Meshuga. And then, when you master the technique, you can play anything you could imagine. And here is the technique in slow-mo to better see the motion.
In my personal case, I'm surprised to see that my left foot is better in single stroke technique than my right one. I didn't work this foot technique. I don't know where it came from, but it did, and I'm very glad about that. If you checked my Within Destruction cover, you would have seen that I used this foot technique in my left foot for some blast beats. This is the heel up technique, the same one I'm using when I'm doing slow stuff, but because of the speed, I cannot move my leg that fast, so I need my ankle to do the motion. Last thing, if you wonder about what type of shoes I'm using, I'm using the Dread Team ones. It allows me to have one single pair of shoes for my drumming with a great comfort and stability. Thank you for watching this video, I hope it was helpful for you and see you in the next one about my hand technique. Bye.